A steel lattice tower structure is a freestanding framework tower that is constructed using bolt connected steel members usually galvanized for longer lifespan. Lattice towers are normally assembled on the ground and set in sections by crane or gin poles, but in really hard and difficult to reach areas or places with limited access, they are set with a helicopter. Due to the high commercial and residential electricity demand and consumption, high capacity and long span transmission line systems are widely used throughout the world. Bolted connections are the main load transferring component in transmission tower systems and their efficacy is related to the structural behaviors of members and towers. The two main bolted connection types used in transmission towers are, the lap splice bolted connection which is usually used for long primary members, example leg members, to form a continuous member, and the lapped bolted connection, single bolt and multi bolts, which is designed for connecting secondary members, example bracing, to restrain and afford stiffness to primary members. Design loads that are usually included in the design of transmission tower system are, dead loads including the weight of all of the structure and its attachments, wind loads, accidental load, one of the compulsory loads that includes the unbalanced loads resulting from the assumed broken wire condition, and other loads include earthquake loads, maintenance, and construction loads. The mathematical modeling is an important step in the design of steel lattice towers. Steel lattice towers are treated as a pin-jointed skeletal system, they consist of bolted connection, main structural members, example leg members, and bracing systems. A tower line system consists of single towers, conductors, the conducting wires, insulators, the connections between towers and conductors, and earth wires. In order to obtain reliable analysis results from numerical simulations, all components should be accurately modeled. Conductors are heavy, flexible, and swinging cable elements, except for the end connections, they can reach free restrained conditions, free in translation and rotation. Under strong wind, conductors can sway, vibrate, and may even break, hence in numerical models, the cable elements should be capable of simulating dynamic and highly nonlinear behaviors. Steel lattice transmission towers and the associated transmission line systems are considered vital infrastructure in modern society, thus, their safety and reliability are important, as failure of the same could result in significant economic and social impact. Transmission towers, as they look like tall ladders, can be attractive and enticing to some children and adults. However, they should never climb a transmission tower, as only qualified utility personnel with specialized tools and safety gear can climb transmission towers safely.